Hi guys, normal introduction, looking at my ugly face. Um, I was uh, gigging the weekend, um, as in it's just started. Gigging last night, I didn't get back home until half past one in the morning. I was at work all day and then I uh, went off to do my gig. Um, got back half past one this morning, had a bit of a lie in. Did myself some uh, breakfast and come down here, down to the allotment. And uh, did a bit, and then had a had a bit of a break. So I might know as normal up per pod out. I caught a bit, of covered, uh, laughing a joke, and a bit of a chat. And then I come back down this afternoon. Um, and I've cleared up quite a well. I think I've cleared up quite a bit, considering that I'm not really got loads of energy. But anyway, it's getting there slowly, like I've always said. Just need some dry weather like this. Um, it's going to rain tomorrow, but then uh, apparently the rest of the week it's going to be really uh, quite nice. Uh, it's going to be warm actually. Um, don't mind it being cooler. It's just the dryness, just need it a bit drier, that's all. Let it dry it a bit. Um, but anyway, I'll stop rambling. Um, I'll just show you what I've done. Well, guys, um, here you go. Not a lot there, you think? No. But I am starting to dig my tom my tomato. Why does it say like tomatoes or strawberries? They're getting mixed up. Anyway, these are potatoes. Let me get myself out of the sh shadow. These are my potatoes. First one here. Um, it's a bit early really for main crop, but they're chitting so well. Um, nice big healthy, whatever. So I'm just going to do it because otherwise I'll, I'll never get done. My earlies, first earlies are in tubs. Um, but these are my, 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 my Sarpo Um I'm just going to stick them in. Uh, 16 of them, I'm just going to get them in two uh, trenches. Um, anyway, different bed from last year, which was that one, and I just shoved them in again, they're exactly the same. And they did brilliantly, I've never never known anything, I'm still eating them now. Coming on to the last few, but um, I'm still eating them, so they've been great. Um, but the other thing I've done... Da -da. If you look at some of my old uh, videos, you'll know that this uh, it's all um, wasn't too bad, but it was all green over. So I've dug all that over. I've actually dug this over. I've put chicken pellets in it and blood snot and bone um, and, and various other bits and pieces, and I've dug it all over. I've cleared the tubs out as well, and I've put them all in my Daleks. Got to get some carpet from home to cover all these holes up because I think I've lost some of my flaps and they're not going to compost otherwise because it won't get that hot. Um, the other thing I was going to do today, but I'm running out of time because I've got another gig tonight at seven, which is now half past five. Um, we're going to get all this into there with the leaf mold as well, with the leaves anyway, and just shove it all in there, clear this area then, and then at least that's in that place there and it can walk down do whatever it wants um these beds aren't too bad a good break over and uh, break all that up um peas you saw i think a couple of videos ago i've done this side and a little bit into there i haven't had a chance to finish it off but again that won't take too long um i've done this bean trench as well I've done all that cleaned all that up as well it's all uh, fertilised, pelleted, and whatever you want to call it. There's my. Uh, oops, I cleared all the paths with all the stuff that was on. Yeah, there's loads of bits left, but I'll get the broom on tomorrow. Um, so let me book it here. Um, so yes, yeah, so I'm just doing that, and I'm going to have to give up because I'm going to get myself cleaned up. I'm going to have some tea as well before I go out. Um, Luckily the gig's only down the road, so it's not going to take too long to get there, so. Um, polytunnel. I've lost my garlic. Uh, I thought I would. Put it in so late at home. It's just, it's gone all soft and no good at all. The man or beast. Some of it might survive, I don't know. But anyway, it's a shame because everybody that watches me, I love my garlic. Got me elephant garlic growing. Schlotz are okay, splitting nicely now. Onions are starting to grow. Uh, things are starting to grow. Um, if you remember my strawberry plants that I saved, I'm quite pleased with those. 
I think it's they're still damp, so I'm not gonna. Uh, what's that? Cabbage. Some cabbage there. Cabbage ceilings are coming up. These are my leeks. Yes, they're late, but they are starting to show their ugly faces. Um, talking of ugly faces. Broad beans starting to come through. Yes, again, I oh, know they're late. Not in that one there. Tomorrow's plants. Uh, here you go. Um, peppers and chilies now. That's just about coming. These are all different tubs of, of various um, that's basil again, basil, mint. What's that one? Coriander, parsley. Parsley's that I, I saved from last year. They seem to be doing okay. Uh, these are chives. Yep, start to come through now. Chitting potatoes, that's the uh, salt amara. I'm just gonna bang them out, get them out. Uh, my mum's uh, grapevine is actually budding and it is growing. Thank God for that, I didn't kill it off. That's his permanent home now. Peas haven't shown, I have watered them again. Um, but it's so hot in here it's um it was 36.5 can you see that reset it uh, reset 28.1 at the moment in here so that's 82.6 fahrenheit i think i might have to open the vents i didn't think i'd be saying that after the year we've had um i've sown some more See, actually, I've done some my, my butternut squash butterfly f ones. Those are from the packet, but I've got some. I'm going to start off from the seeds from my old one, the thirteen pound months that I grew last year. Sweet corns in. I'm trying to keep out the sun. I don't want it too. It's warm in here, so I don't want it drying out too much. But um, so yeah, that's the polytunnel. Top end, I haven't done anything apart from put a sage plant in there, which looks like it's on its last legs. It's been inside the polytunnel in a tub. Um, I don't know what it's going to do. It's a bit dead. It might come up, you don't know. But anyway, let's see. Chives, lavender, lavender and chives again, the same here. I'm going to do this ever so slowly, but I'm terrible at this. Um, strawberry plants, there's runners gone everywhere. They've started to go into the pathway, and it's just a right mess. Um, guess what's going to happen tomorrow afternoon? Yeah, that's my next plan of action. Uh, I'll clean all this up tomorrow as well. Chards regrowing some of its yeah. We need to just get rid of the dead one. But look at this with the sunlight. Right? These are absolutely cannibalistic again. I mean they're so healthy these for fine. I've never grown a stuff in my life and I thought last year I'd just left them and I thought, oh that's the old stuff there, but the new. So what do I do? Earth them up or something? I don't know. Comment down below, let me know please. <clears throat> but again these. Been eaten a bit, but uh, you know what? If the birds eat those, fine. Let them eat them. I think that one's died now. You never know now. The celery on here did die, but uh, yeah, I'm going to clean all that out, ready for the next uh, batch of stuff. Pigeon poop in the bags. Got to go into this bed. No, be no dig bed. But it's not that bad, actually. Um, they're chuffed with the uh, rhubarbs at the front. They're doing okay, aren't they? In the traffic comes down here, you can see. Um, it's right on the edge. This one's doing great guns. 
I mean, so I was here. Oh, yeah, I should be picking some of that soon. What do you reckon, guys? Let's zoom out a bit. Um, it isn't messy, but I think it's doing all right. Um, I definitely think this is comfrey. That's called, I think that's called a dandelion. I'm going to have to dig the roots out. Don't pull them out, by the way, guys. Anybody out there, you're probably a lot more wise than me, but any newcomers, don't just pull them out. Pull, dig the whole root out. I've just dug loads out of actually this bed here. Um, I should have kept some to show you um, the roots on them, but they're like they're like carrots. The root system on them, and they just they will just carry on going. But anyway, there you go. Still a bit of a mess, but it's getting there slowly. In the day, if it puts food on my plate, I don't care what it looks like. To be perfectly honest, I've gone past that point of making it all prim and proper. It's a working allotment. We have had um, a load of saw. Um, so I was going to say sawdust then. A load of. Um, wood chippings etc delivered some of it hasn't been chipped up very much but there is some at the top end um so tomorrow afternoon if there's any left i'm gonna well i'm actually thinking of just throwing it all in the back of the car not even putting put a bag in just so I'll clean it up later and then drive it back down to top and get the top done and then start wheelbarrowing it down the bottom here and get all these paths done but this membrane's done great it's been down for a couple of years now Oh, there's always going to be bits hanging over here because I haven't stapled these to here. But um, it could have been a hell of a lot worse, guys. Anyhow, this is 12 minutes long, which I know some people start switching off. Um, so from the wonky shed, which is still up, it's still going, the wonky donkey shed. And the wonky donkey polytunnel with this new cover and the wonky donkey me thanks for watching subscribing please comment um, and I'm off to do my gig it's a soul band gig so uh, a bit like the gig I did last night um, but yes doing that gig tonight so it should be fun starts at half eight I've got to be there just after seven so I will say half seven, but uh, yep, should be good fun. And then I've got race in the morning with my band, my big band. See, then lovely, hopefully have have a lovely Sunday dinner with my mum and dad. So I'm gonna cook, oh, wonder bar. And then uh, guess what? Yep, back down here. Life's too short. Get it sorted. Cheers, guys. Thank you. I'll leave you with a. Lovely picture above the poly tunnel and hopefully the sun without blinding you. There you go. The sunny parts of Netherton. Cheers guys. Bye bye.